So this finally got here yesterday. I ordered it maybe two or three months ago and got the slowest shipping so it took forever. But yeah, it's finally here now and it looks like it comes with all four of these. Moria, Nightmare Luffy, Brook, and Chopper. That Chopper must be like extremely small. So here's the back of the box. There's some of the other sets you can get. And each of them comes with a little piece to build the Mary. So if you get all of them, then you can build this. But yeah, I'm super excited to finally have a Moria that's in scale with the world scale ores. So let's see. What the hell is this? Candy or something? I don't know. Let's see. So there's Moria, Luffy, and Book and Chopper are just extremely small. I forgot to bring scissors, so I'm just gonna have to tear this open. chunk of the Mary that I'll never do anything with because I doubt I'll ever get all the sets but I mean I do kind of want them so maybe someday look at chopper look at that my god that's the smallest chopper in existence maybe all right so there he is he's got no paint on his face or his head it's just plain but it does have his you can see his face is there there's just like no paint and then his body, these aren't painted in yellow, just a very basic miniature Moria, but I love it because it's to scale with the oars, so it's really nice. And also this, this Luffy is also to scale. So it'll be nice to display that with oars and actually have it the actual size. I'm kind of terrified to open this chopper because I'm going to lose him. But I guess not if I put him directly on the base. See if it's possible to focus on this. There's Brook, but he's black, so he kind of blends in with the glove. But there he is. Extremely small. Now let's see this damn chopper. Oh my god. There he is. The smallest chopper to exist. I can barely even hold this thing without without covering it. Let's see. So here's the base. It says 144 volt scale. And then this chunk just hooks in right there. And I thought they were all going to be able to hook into this actually, but it looks like there's no peg holes and they don't have any pegs. So I guess they just kind of stand on there, however you want to put them. Which isn't it, it's not an issue for these two, but Brook and Chopper. I feel it is an issue for because they're so small that if they fall, they can get lost easily. But all right, let's see. I got Chopper. It's going to be pretty hard to get Chopper to stand up, but I got to do it. I might just end up like gluing him on, but no, I don't think so. Okay, there he is. So get a look all the way around. And I just love Thriller Bark, all the characters, so so I really like this. There he died. They all died. So now Ors is here, so let's see how he looks with Moria. I really love this line. I wish they would have continued it because it's like the 
only line that was making One Piece characters to scale with each other. And, you know, there's so many huge characters and small characters. You can't, there's not really any line that has them all actually to scale. So this was a really nice line to have, but... But yeah, they stopped doing it pretty early on. And I mean, at least they did, at least they did Thriller Bark, you know? So here's Moria, Brooke, and Luffy all with oars. And I just love being able to see them actually to scale. That's just really amazing. Could probably put him in his mouth. Here we can get a better look at the Luffy. Great. All right, let's see the back. If he would stop falling. Okay, there. There's the back. I mean, these are so small, they're not going to have, like, extremely great paint jobs, but they look really good for what they are, I think. Good enough. And here's Brook and Chopper, both extremely small. And the Moria. Paint could be better on this, but it's extremely small. Not quite as small as the other ones, so it could have been painted a little better, but I still love it because it's Gecko Moria. See him up close here. Can see his face better. And his body. And now I gotta see where I can fit them into my Thriller Bark shelf. So here's that Pepsi Gecko Moria that I opened a few videos ago. Let's see how he looks with the world scale. So he is a little bit bigger than him. So this Mario isn't quite to scale with the oars. He's a little too big. But this Ichiban Kuji oar is about, it's about the same size as the world scale. So I'd say this world scale Moria is to scale with oars. Yeah, I'm not sure where I'm going to want to put him. Okay, so here is the spot. I move that WCF oars out of the way and put them right here. So I like how oars is right behind them so you could really get the sense of the size difference so yeah that's where they're gonna be and i gotta find a spot for him now